Dear students, in this lecture, we shall learn about taking an adjoint of a matrix. Let us see an example through which we shall try to understand that a matrix ka adjoint kaise calculate hota hai. We must remember that adjoint is a very useful uh, calculation that we can do from a matrix. Or further, it helps us to matrix ke analysis. Ko karne mein madad deta hai. For example, if we calculate matrix ka determinant, then we need to calculate adjoint. Ki Right now, we will adjoint ko calculate the uh, Straight away, we are taking an example. Uh, we have considered a matrix which is in a general form. Mein hai. Because you can see A11, A12, you know, this is a kind of formation that tells us that we consider a matrix in a general form. Ke Representing that this first row or the second row or the third row. Or this way, the placement of columns is placement hai, wo hai. third column, second column and first column. So, uh, this is very much clear that this is general form. Hai. Now, we should also remember from uh, other modules that we have studied that cofactors are what they are. Cofactors are knowledge that we use to use all elements to calculate cofactors. You can see that we have stacked all cofactors in cofactors in their natural position. Mein. It means that A11 के लिए जो हमने जो cofactor calculate किया है, वो उसकी ही जगह पर हमने mention कर दिया. Whereas the difference is that it is written in capital letter, that is capital A instead of small A. इसी तरीके से A33 जो है, वो भी हमारे लिए उसी position पे आएगा जहाँ पर उसका original element था. So, this calculation definitely it will require some values, some calculations, which I leave for rehearsal ke liye hun, because we have done these things in modules. Mein kar chuke. Yahan par hamara tha ke hum, uh, ke ek ko form the main goal was to make a matrix of cofactors. And we have made it. Now, the fact is that it has a certain name. Hai. Yes, there is. It is called as adjugate matrix. Where we place cofactors in their natural positions. Par place karte now the next step in this process is that we will transpose calculate kar lenge, adjugate matrix ka. and all of us should remember from the previous modules that we transpose mein hum rows ko columns mein convert kar sakte hai. otherwise we columns ko row mein convert kar, kar, kar sakte hai. definitely we will not use both processes we will use option ko use one option here you can see that we convert columns mein convert kar diya. because ye पहले एक रो थी अब ये एक कॉलम बन चुका है तो so, इसका मतलब है कि हमने रोज को कॉलम्स में कन्वर्ट कर दिया दिस वाज द सेकंड रो एंड दैट वाज द थर्ड रो व्हिच हैज नाउ बिकम सेकंड एंड थर्ड कॉलम्स रिस्पेक्टिवली नाउ ये जो ट्रांसपोज्ड फैक्टर है जो कि एजुकेट का ट्रांसपोज है इसको हम Finally, we can say that it is the adjoint matrix. The one thing that we were looking for, now we have the value of it. Speaking of value, we don't have the numerical value of this result. Therefore, it is very much suitable to take a numerical example and then see how it can help us to understand. Now, you can see we have a numerical example consider here. There is a matrix A having order of uh, 3 into 3. We can calculate the matrix for cofactors. A11, cofactors as you know, you can calculate the cofactors. For example, A11, we consider it and this row and this column we will omit. We will be left with 3, 7, 1 and 3. Which means 3 into 3 minus 7 into 1. So the answer would be 6 minus 7. Apology, uh, answer would be 3 into 3 is equal to 9 minus 7 into 1 which is 7. So the answer would be 2. So here you can see the value is 2. So in this way, for your rehearsal, A12, A13, A21 and the jitne bhi cofactors you can calculate aap kar sakte hai, and then you should put them into their natural positions. This is where we are putting them in their natural positions 
और जो प्रोसेस करने के बाद हमारे पास जो मेट्रिक्स बनेगा उसे हम एडजुकेट मेट्रिक्स कह सकते हैं एज यू कैन सी हमने सारे को uh, फैक्टर्स को प्लेस कर दिया उनकी नेचुरल पोजीशन पे बट आई होप यू रिमेंबर दैट दिस इज़ नॉट द एड जॉइंट वी वर लुकिंग फॉर एक्चुअली द एड जॉइंट इज द ट्रांसपोज ऑफ द एड एडजुकेट मेट्रिक्स सो देर फोर आप देख सकते हैं कि हमने पहली रो को पहला कॉलम बना दिया और इसी तरीके से सेकेंड रो को सेकेंड कॉलम बना दिया और जो हमारे पास थर्ड रो थी उसको हमने थर्ड कॉलम बना दिया सो दैट नाओ वी कैन कॉल द एड जॉइंट मैट्रिक्स समथिंग दैट वी वर लुकिंग फॉर 